Welcome to Jen the Real Fluencer and another edition of Spring 2021 Wow Week. Wow Week stands for Week of Walmart. We're essentially kind of like fitting room style. I go through really like a giant Walmart haul categorically so that you really only have to tune into the things that you're most interested in. So in this video, we're really getting into all sorts of pants. I do have like jeans, kind of summery jeans, summery kind of pants even, as well as joggers, just really anything that can be categorized as a pant is what we're doing in this specific video. And before we get started, I just wanna point out that I do have a couple other wow weeks. So definitely if you're new to my channel, go check those out. Some stuff is still available. Some stuff is clearance, believe it or not. I actually did recently start a series on my channel here called Walmart Weekly, where usually one, maybe two times a week as a YouTube short, I'm uploading like a one minute video of just kind of recent Walmart finds. Some of the stuff are making them in the wow week, some of them aren't. So definitely check those out and subscribe if you love Walmart because we do a lot of Walmart on this channel. Let's get into the pants. <laughs> well, I'm gonna be featuring all of the pants and pairing them with shoes that I think are kind of cute. I don't know that I'll be featuring any of these shoes in another video, so I at least wanted to share my finds with you. They're not necessarily Walmart shoes, so if you are interested, I will link them along with all of the pants down in the description box below. These pants here do come in several colors. They're by no boundaries. I have them here in an extra large. I did end up ordering an XXL because I feel like that would be probably my true no boundary size. It's not like they were so big on me that it was ridiculous, but they were less flattering. I would say that if you're interested in a fit like how they're fitting me here, I would go down your normal no boundary size by one size. I really wanted to include these because, I mean, of course they kind of look like that beachy vibe because they're like linen, long walks on the beach kind of a pants. But I really love the tassel drawstring. That's a fake drawstring, by the way. It doesn't provide any actual ability to tighten the pants. I really loved how the legs were. I think it's really cool that you have both options. I used to be someone where I literally never wore shorts and it's challenging in the summertime if you're that type of person that does not wanna wear shorts. They are just under 15 bucks and I think paired with these shoes, it's just, it's just darling. These jeans here are actually clearance. They're such a great price at $14. This light gray, like acid wash situation is just completely the vibe for me. I have nothing like this, so I was very intrigued by these. They're by Scoop and I'm in a 14, so I feel like they run true to size. 99% cotton and they have 1% elastane, so there is a little bit of stretch here. They're not like a super high rise, but they're also not a low waist either. And they're great for summer too because they are a little shorter. No boundaries. They actually kind of remind me of the first pair of pants, but just in a jogger. They certainly are more stretchy though. Cute little tassel drawstring here is also a fake drawstring. I just love these things. Gauzy type of material, which again is very stretchy. I went down a size in these from my normal. These are another one where I tried them in an XL and an XXL. Pictured here are in an XL. They just certainly fit fit better, especially because of how stretchy these are. So I definitely would recommend going down a size in these. Beachy, summery feel, even though they are still a pant. Just under 15 bucks, and they do come in the green and the black, and obviously I got them in both colors. <laughs> We've got my girl, Sofia Vergara. I'm obsessed with this jeans line. This is another pair that are brand new. These they describe on the website as high rise, slim, straight. If you happen to see my last Wow Week video, which was strictly all on shirts, these are the jeans that I actually wore throughout that entire video as well. So you can kind of see them here up close. They're just under $27. Like most of her jeans, they do run true to size and I'm in my normal size 14. They do have a 1% stretch to them. Really like them. Definitely keeping these. 
time and true. They're a high rise and wide leg, but they do have a crop that's frayed. I don't have shapewear on with these. And you know, I'll say, I don't think they look overly flattering on me. Pants like this are a little bit challenging. These are a little bit more to be totally honest than I think they should be. They're around $22. I feel like sometimes time and true jeans are less than $20. So I don't really know why these are 22 bucks, but they have a lot of different colors. If you are somebody that's confident in wearing white, they do have a white pair. I think that particularly would look beachy. There is a good amount of stretch to these. I'm in my true size 14. I think that they fit well. Again, I don't think they look great, but I think they do fit well. Another one, I don't think these look overly great on me, but I will say I love the vibe. For this one, I'm gonna pop up what the model looks like on the website, cause dang, does she look so much better than me? And you'll kind of see the vibe, just really cool. They're overly wide leg and overly kind of grungy. I, I love, of course, that they're high rise and I feel like they do run true to size. They're $28, I think that's a, a good price for scoop. They do have 1% spandex, so there's definitely some stretch here. So here's my first true pant that is, you know, I wouldn't really call these a summer, spring, any kind of pant. They're just, they're just pants. They're joggers. Uh, do love the cargo pockets here. They're certainly a high rise and I really love the drawstring. This is a true drawstring that will help you out if they are loose by any chance. They're by no boundaries. I found them to run kind of like everything else has been running here. I, I guess a little big, I have them in an extra large and I think that they do well. These are 60% cotton, 40% polyester. So there certainly is a little bit of a stretch here. Yeah, I really like these, but certainly I can't tell you that these are springy summer cause uh, they're not. <laughs> another pair of scoop jeans. They call them a wide leg jean. Maybe they're just not wide on me because I have wide legs. It's like, do you say French toast when you're in France? I don't know. So do you say wide leg jeans when you have them on a wide leg? I feel like these on me at least are a little bit more of just like a flare jean with maybe a little bit of width there, but I loved the seam down the front and the pocket detailing the high rise. I love everything about these jeans. I just don't know that I love them on me. They're very stretchy. I know it doesn't look like I could really go down a size and I probably to be honest wouldn't I'm in a 14 but could I button a 12 like I probably could we have another jogger no boundaries they are $15 they come in about four different colors I think they do look a little bit more springy summer certainly than the last jogger that we saw they're that true like khaki material there's a little bit of stretch here I'm also in an extra large, kind of, again, the same story. I ordered an XXL and an XL. I just thought the XXL was too big. I love the level of thickness here though. I mean, they're not like overly thick, but they just, they feel substantial, almost completely opposite to that gauzy one that we saw earlier that I said is very like airy, summery feel. Honestly, there's been so many situations where I need a pair of khakis and I just don't have them. I love the level of high rise that they are. And I think that they're a little bit more, you know, I wouldn't, I wouldn't call them dressy, but they don't have cargo pockets like the last pair. I don't know that I'm keeping all three colors. I think I'm hands down gonna keep the two khaki colors as I just described that I need khakis. Um, but yeah, anyway, really do like these. All right, so that will do it. Thank you so much for tuning in. Make sure to subscribe so that you don't miss any of the future Wow Week videos and you'll be notified every time I upload. And also, if you did like the video, I would really appreciate it if you actually hit the like button. <laughs>